Hello again, welcome to basics of noise and its measurement. Uh, we have been discussing about different types of uh, microphones and now we will move to the next stage in our discussion and uh, we will introduce one very important param parameter known as microphone sensitivity because uh, understanding of this particular parameter will help us make uh, intelligent uh, judgments about whether a microphone meets our uh, needs or not. So that is what we are going to talk about in this particular uh, lecture and uh, the theme will be microphone sensitivity. So what is microphone sensitivity? It is essentially a quantitative number through we, which we can say how sensitive a microphone is in terms of sending, sensing uh, the noise which it is supposed to sense. So I will define that mic sensitivity tells us how much electrical output in volts is generated by a microphone for a specific reference SPL okay that is what microphone sensitivity tells us suppose I have a reference SPL of 1 Pascals and there is one microphone which produces 1 volt of electrical signal and there is another microphone which is producing 3 volts of electrical signal then the second microphone is 3 times more sensitive than the first one so that is what it means. Now the units of this particular uh, parameter are also in decibels and we will define it. So LS is the sensitive sensitivity of microphone in decibels in decibels and that is equal to 20 log of 10 and that divided by y divided by y ref okay and I will explain these parameters. So ls is the value of this sensitivity which I calculate using this formula and that sensitivity is uh, prescribed in decibels so the units are decibels and that is nothing but 20 log of 10 of y over y ref. Now y is equal to volts generated when mic is exposed to some please remember I am using this term called sum sum reference pressure. Now when we were gen defining sound pressure level in decibels our reference pressure was 20 micro Pascals. The same reference pressure is not uh, here, here we use something different here we use something different. So and we will tell you what that is okay but it is not 20 micro Pascals okay and then y ref is equal to volts generated by a reference microphone.
when it is exposed to same. So, this same reference pressure ok. This pressure and this pressure they are same volts generated by a reference microphone when it is exposed and this reference microphone need not be a real microphone we can just imagine some thing ok. So, we will continue this further. Now, typically this reference microphone which is some imaginary microphone y ref is typically in one set of cases it is 1 volt per Pascal. What does this mean? That if you have your reference microphone which is this imaginary microphone and you expose it to 1 Pascal of pressure it will generate 1 volts. So, our sensitivity of our microphone which we want to calibrate is being measured with respect to this reference microphone which is an imaginary microphone which may not exist, but its own sensitivity is 1 volt per Pascal. In a lot of cases it is 1 volt per Pascal, in some cases it is a different number we will talk about that also ok. So, y ref is 1 volt per Pascal and this is for reference microphone and then if that is the case then y will be some volts per Pascal and that will be for R microphone right that is what we are interested in. So, this is this is how many volts we do not know. So, that is why I put a question mark here some volts per microphone. Now, I will give you an example so that you understand it better. So, let us say that I have microphone. So, this is my microphone and its sensitivity L s is minus 26 decibels. Suppose, its sensitivity is minus 26 decibels and and the reference microphone is reference microphone I should always mention what is reference microphone. Reference microphone is giving me 1 volt per Pascal. Then uh, question how many volts will my mic generate at 110 decibels of sound scale of sound pressure level ok. So, I want to know that if I am having this microphone in air and it is measuring noise at 110 decibels then what is going to be the voltage which will be generated by this microphone. So, we will do this. So, first L s equals minus 26 dB this dB is same as this one this is not 110 decibels. So, this equals 20 log of 10 y divided by y ref and the value of y ref is 1 volt per Pascal ok. So, this is equal to one volt per Pascal right. So, I have to calculate first y. So, y equals 10 to the power of minus 26 divided by 20 into 1 volt per Pascal. This is 1 volt per Pascal 
and that equals 10 to the power of minus 1.3 volts per Pascal. And if I do the calculations, I get 0 0.0501 volts per Pascal. So, what does this tell me? That if I have this reference with respect to reference microphone, my micro microphone is 26 decibels less sensitive. Then my mic so the reference microphone will produce 1 volt for each Pascal. My microphone is going to produce 0 0.0501 volts per Pascal. This is what it means. Now with this sensitivity, I am going to calculate how much volts it will generate when it is subjected to 110 decibels of sound pressure level. So this is step one. And then step two, find pressure in Pascals. Okay. So I know that 1 110 dB is equal to 20 log 10 and here this 110 decibels is coming from here. Okay. P RMS divided by reference pressure 2 into 10 to the power of minus 5. So, if I do all this, what I get is P RMS is equal to 10 to the power of 110 divided by 20 into 2 into 10 to the power of minus 5 and that equals 6.324 Pascals. So, P RMS equals 6.324 Pascals and P peak, see because we had discussed earlier that R RMS is not same as peak, the peak will be higher and if peak is and if the signal is sinusoidal in nature, so I am going to then it will be 6.324 into 1.414. This is only only for sine wave, okay. For other ways, this number has to be different. So we have to remember this. So this equals. So anyway, this 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 uh, you can calculate this 6.324 times 1.414. Okay, so then VRMS, which my microphone will generate, will be 6.324 into 0 0.0501. This equals 0 0.317 volts. Okay. and V peak equals 0 0.317 into 1.414 equals 0 0.4482 volts. So, this is the, so this is how we calculate how much voltage will my microphone generate. Now, I had mentioned earlier that in all this calculation, our reference value of y was 1 volt per Pascal. Our reference value was 1 volt per Pascal. And this is the reference value used in a good number of microphones. This is a fairly industry, a fairly industry standard value, one volt per Pascal. But there are some microphones which don't use this value, and there they use a different reference value. So in some mics, YREF is not equal to 1 volt per Pascal, rather YREF 
equals 1 volt per micro bar okay 1 volt for 1 micro bar now what is 1 bar 1 bar is approximately equal to 10 to the power of 5 pascals so 1 micro bar is equal to 0 0.1 pascals okay so we will do the calculation again so example so 1 micro bar so if you have this reference uh, value of y then if the microphone is having same sensitivity then the num amount of voltage which it will generate it will be different okay and it will be actually 10 times larger so we will do that example and just confirm it so here mic sensitivity in earlier case was minus 26 decibels and instead of reference value of y reference is 1 volt per micro bar okay and then the question is how many volts at 110 db spl so we'll just do this calculation once again okay so in this case ls equals minus 26 equals 20 log of 10 y divided by 1 volt per micro bar right so my value of y equals 10 to the power of minus 1.3 into 1 volt per micro bar and that is equal to how much 0 0.0501 volts per micro bar or I can calculate it as for so many volts for 0 0.1 pascals or I can write it as 0 0.501 volts per pascal. So now with this calibration the value of if I do the whole math again I had calculated now we had earlier calculated found for 110 decibel P RMS was how much 0.316 volts then V RMS will be 0 0.317 into sorry 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 it is 6.324 pascals so V RMS will be equal to 0 0.501 times 6.324 and that equals 3.17 volts So using this we have again found the value of how many volts my microphone is going to generate but the point what I tried to make in this illustration was that it is extremely important that we remember what is the reference value of uh, Y for the microphone because the supplier may have given us uh, a calibration that oh its sensitivity is minus 40 decibels. But before we convert that into voltage, we should remember that what is the reference value of Y which he used while giving us that sensitivity value. Because if we do not know that then we may be totally off in our calculation of how many voltages it is going to my microphone is going to generate for a uh, given value of sound pressure level. So that is important to understand and once we know that then we can fairly straightforwardly uh, compute how many volts my microphone is going to generate for how much pressure of sound. 
So, that uh, concludes my this lecture and we will continue this discussion uh, in the next lecture as well and till then thank you and have a great day bye.